New at 10, controversy surrounding a roundabout in North Scottsdale. A city council member says that they are already tens of millions of dollars over budget for the project. 12 News journalist Chase Golightly is joining us now in Scottsdale with the details. And Chase, they're already tens of millions over budget. How much more is this thing going to cost? Well, creepy in total, all this will cost $43 million, way higher than what the city originally thought they were going to pay for. And now that city council member says other projects that were already planned may suffer because of it. Scottsdale Road, just north of the 101, is about to go through some big changes. And it's also going to come with a big price tag. It's very concerning. Scottsdale Vice Mayor Barry Graham is talking about a roundabout that will replace the intersection at Dynamite Boulevard. He says it's been in the works since 2019, where the city was originally told it was going to cost $13 million. Then last month, the city learned that price tag increased to $43 million. Three times over budget, that's a 215% increase. We're told the increase is due to inflation and the city having to buy up more land for the project. Graham and another city council member voted against it, but it still passed. That means that other projects are going to be deferred, if not canceled. Um, because there's only, there's only so much. Now the project is more than just a roundabout. Two miles of Scottsdale Road will also go through major safety changes, including culverts to prevent street flooding, which is a problem here. It's part of Scottsdale's master transportation plan, where they are working on expanding several streets to relieve traffic congestion. I think it needs to be broadened because there's too much traffic on the road. Which people who take this road every day support. It's very congested, especially during morning and evening hours. But for $43 million? You know, I hate when it goes over budget. It seems a little insane to me. Graham also pointed out that the city did receive a federal grant of $31 million, which will cover a majority of the cost. Still, he thinks that money should have been spent elsewhere. It's all our tax dollars, so we got to spend it wisely. Construction will begin starting next month, and a city spokesperson told me that it should be completed by sometime in 2026. We're live in Scottsdale tonight. Chase Golightly, 12 News.